Okay, so I've opened my pop and cooking and like nothing prepares you for the smells of this. Like, here, let me turn the camera around. I just opened this and oh, it smells so good. So I don't have a tripod, so I'm not gonna be able to like do the entire thing with like the camera. I don't know. I'm gonna make something more. Yeah, so I can't figure out how to like really make it so that I can like set the camera up to see what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna tell you what I'm doing and then like show you as I get progress. So right now I'm squishing out the seaweed into the shape. I can do it. Yes, I know you can totally tell what's going on. I'm doing great. So anyway, come on, mom's there. Right, I just squished out the seaweed, and next I'm going to look at the box. Make some rice. Fill the oval with n number one with water, and then add blue powder. Add powder from the blue packet still until thick like cooked rice. So I'm gonna get a dish to put some water in. Yeah. I, I don't know how cameras work, obviously. Filling up a glass, making sure I'm not getting warm water because I feel like that would make it not work as well. Okay, now the water's chilly. It's filled up and it's soaking wet, so I'm gonna dry my hand off because, you know, I'm great at this. Hi, I'm a YouTuber. Like and subscribe and comment. I'll put my hands back over the camera. Alrighty, so I am finding the dropper, filling. Let me switch the camera around again. I'm just propping this up so you can enjoy looking at me at this angle. So, filling the oval up. And then I will switch the camera angle when I have the oval filled up. And this is like kind of lopsided. It's a little wibbly wobbly. So I'm going to have to like hold this this way. You can't see my struggles. Okay, it's almost full. We're going to call that good. So, switching camera again, one second. I filled up the oval with water. This is blue and it's rice. So, let's open this real quick. It smells like bubble gum. Does it just say like pour it all on in there? Yep, just add the, the powder. There we go. Making sure I get it all out. That was not smart. Keeping it. Basically, I'd gotten some into the wrong thing, so I tried to blow it out. I was watching a Christmas video while filming this, so now I'm just gonna pop into the voiceover. When I watched Strawberry17 do the same pop and cook in box, she kinda chopped up the rice after it was fully mixed together, so I'm just gonna do a little bit of that to give it the right texture too. Next I'm gonna do the omelette. I sped it up so it seems even choppier. First we gotta fill up the omelet section with some water, if I can figure out how this dropper thing works. Fill it up to the line, it's gonna take a couple of squeezes. I think that's pretty good. Alright, let me find the packet real quick. Pour it in the packet, time to mix it around, which is hard when I'm holding the camera in one hand. So I'm gonna set this down to keep mixing real quick. I did both the omelette and the salmon, 
So I'm finishing mixing this one around. It's really satisfying. And then I'm going to squish it flattish and leave it to set. Alright, time to figure out this bubble stuff. I emptied both packets into where they need to go. One in A and one in B. So once it's thoroughly combined, we're going to use the little droppy drop and take it from out of the orange one. I think that one is A. Take it from out of the orange thingy thing. Oh, it was B. Drop it into A. And wow, That's this was so magical. satisfying, like, I cannot even explain how nice this is. Like, you can obviously see it, but it's a completely different magic oh my God, when so you're looking at it in person versus through the screen. And, like, you don't even have That's to be really careful incredible. that one drop comes out at a time. I'm gonna go finish that part up. Time to assemble our candy sushi. We're gonna put some eggy boy on top, so first we gotta chop it in half, peel it out. Once we get both halves of the eggy boy on top of the rice balls, we are going to do the same with the salmon. And then we're going to wrap up the remaining larger ball in some seaweed and put those bubble boys on top. It's not exactly staying wrapped, so I'm just gonna hold it while I do the thing, put the stuff on top of it. While I'm holding this, while I'm holding this one, I'm just gonna eat it because I don't want it to fall apart. So let's see, taste test. Nice. I'm just gonna escape, take a scoop of the salmon roll. It's so good. It's just boba. I figured I love it on top of ice cream, so why not alone? Alright, I'm going to make the soy sauce to put on the rest of the other ones. Alrighty, pouring it in. I'm gonna grab my little stir stick. Stir it up. This one doesn't mix me as well as the others. One second, let me get vigorous. Right, I'm going to take the dropper. And put some of this on top of some of this. Oh yes, looks like sushi. And now I'm going to. Oops, I'm blocking it again. I'm gonna drink some. My favorite flavor, sugar. All right, let's try one of these. That was the tuna one. It's okay. All of the other. The rice is definitely my favorite part. Alrighty, now for the omelet. Tastes the same. Alright, well, this is not nearly as good of a video as when Strawberry17 makes them, but it was yummy.